Hey, what's up? It's Chanel. Welcome to a new episode of Vital Vital Vlog. <laughs> and today we're going to be blasting a Blue Hummingbird on the left. Altatranore, Burning Water, Worship Black Twilight on Iron Bonehead and Nuclear War Now. Fuck yeah, I love the Black Twilight Circle, some of the best U.S. black metal in the game. And when it comes to Black Twilight Circle, as much as I love, like, Volon, BHL for the win, the war division of the Black Twilight Circle, it's fucking sick. So good. I've been a fan of the Black Twilight Circle for a while now, and I still feel like I don't know that much about it, besides that I really, really like the music that they put out. It's some of the best U.S. black metal in the game. I really like the whole entire concept, and it's just very interesting. And speaking about U.S. black metal and just... U.S. blackness in general that's, you know, stuff you listen to that's just like, fuck yeah, and it makes the hair on your arms stick up. This next release right here, now, like a lot of you, I'm probably not alone in the fact that I'm waiting for my vinyl pre-order, which is about a little bit going on a month and a half late with no notifications, Zero. The label's out of Mexico, Chaos Records, so you probably know what I'm getting at. But Head Split Records was rad enough to release the cassette. Impure Satan's Eclipse. Holy awesome. Impure Satan's Eclipse. First off, I would have modeled for the position of Jesus Christ here and let you two maniacs hang me up and, you know, take a cool-ass picture. But, uh, I also don't have my own personal cell phone anymore, so it's understandable. But anyways, 12 tracks of just total blasphemous warfare. I... Love, 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 Impure Satan's Eclipse. Every track on here is just chock full of some of the fucking gnarliest riffs you're gonna hear in 2019. Like, I know we have a new Pro Fanatica record coming up, and I don't know if Impure knew that, but... You could tell that these two fucking sickos love Pro Fanatica. So, like, imagine Pro Fanatica and Arch Goat getting together and being like, Hey, why don't we jam together? But let's throw some more, like, death metal elements into the mix and see what happens. Holy shit. Like I said, this is 12 tracks of just some of the most blasphemous just the vicious Christ hating tomes of just evil that you're probably going to hear in 2019 this is so fucking good from the opener death secretion to the title track that closes things off wow I am absolutely in love with Satan's Eclipse. Impure just absolutely knocked this out of the fucking park. And Impure is just a dynamic duo of the horned father of desecration on drums and vocals. And the sad, tyrannical Lord of Assault on guitars and bass. Impurecongregations.com So fucking sick, considering that this was recorded at Moonlight Mile Studios in Hoboken, 
New Jersey, fucking A. This is so vicious, so evil, and I fucking love it. Seriously, like, if you're a fan of, like I said, pretty much Archgoat, Pro Fanatica, boom! You will devour this up. Like the black phlegm dripping from Christ's dying mouth. Yeah, your father will not fucking help you when it comes to this bad boy that is Satan's Eclipse by Impure. A total, total punch in the face to Christianity. And I fucking love it. Seriously. It would be even sicker if they got like a real doll and made it look like Jesus and just did all sorts of like, you know, evil blasphemous stuff that we'll get to see on the vinyl version and maybe that's why it's being held up, but that's just some wishful thinking. But I really like the cosmetics of the cassette. Head Split did a great job here. This sounds great, nice hard shell. It looks awesome. I really like the use of the font and everything. It's just a kick-ass release. And until the vinyl comes, I am more than fucking content with enjoying these 12 tracks of Satanic Savagery on cassette. And it's fucking great. Like, Death Secretion is such a fucking cool song and... If you haven't heard any of this yet, just start there and I guarantee you'll probably listen to the entire album because it's that catchy, good, and memorable. That's one thing a lot of blackened bands don't really, I think, care about anymore and that is writing memorable songs and riffs. Because there's plenty of songs on here I find myself like humming riffs to, and it's fucking awesome. Seriously, Sat Satan's Eclipse is a goddamn masterpiece of just satanic savagery. And hails to Impure for just absolutely nailing Christ's wrist to the cross. Sonically, lyric-wise, holy shit, I fucking love it. Pray to your Lord that darkness may spread. Come, blessed plague, eternal night. Pray to your God that darkness may reign. Come, cursed beast of the unlight. Fucking so good. And I really just, every track on here is so fucking awesome. Like, I can't get over how good of a release this is. And it's a perfect mix of traditional US black metal, war metal, and death metal. It's fucking great. Seriously, I can't recommend this enough to all you fucking sickos out there. Especially if you hate this guy right here. Fuck that guy. But seriously, like, this is... Even if you're a fan of Jesus or whatever... It's all about the fucking tunes on here, you know? Like, seriously. Impure Satan's Eclipse is a masterpiece when it comes to 2019 extreme music. It's just 12 tracks of just... Top shelf, A plus, extreme music. Yeah, it's evil as fuck, but at the same time, I wouldn't want it any other fucking way. This is so well done. The mix is amazing. The riffs are great. The vocal delivery, oh my goodness. Amazing. Impure, Satan's Eclipse. Head Split Records and Chaos Records. A plus, 10 out of 10. Already on my album of the year list. And I don't even have the vinyl version yet. 
I can't stop listening to this cassette. But, like, Death Secretion is probably one of my favorite tracks on here. And that's the opener. From there, it just gets gnarlier. Trust me. Like, Engage in Morbid Ecstasy, again. Like, holy shit. You can, like, smell... The stench of Christ's rotting corpse. It's amazing. Then <laughs> demonic urge in the Sophetic Initiation, Sorceress Maelstrom, Dance of Slaughtered Cherubs, Inexorable Darkness, Sect of Set, Succession of Ancient Thorned God. Throned Gods, sorry, I thought it said Thorned. Black Ovum. Satyranical Desecration. And the title track, Satan's Eclipse. Now, Impure, like I said, absolutely nailed Christ to the cross with this one. Just a total black death masterpiece impure satan's eclipse head split records and chaos records get the fuck into this release and we were blasting black twilight circle burning water aka old tatsunanali amazing amazing stuff from the black twilight circles war division don't forget Worship Black Twilight. Poems and Songs of War. Such an amazing, amazing record here. Love it. And this is two of, in my opinion, the best black releases of the year so far. Alongside... Wow, fuck. You can't forget this bad boy. And my Yellow Eyes record is somewhere between my house and Philadelphia. God forbid, you know, you get four miles done in the fucking weekend. I hate the USPS, but you know who I love? Impure and Satan's Eclipse. If you have a cassette, grab this on Head Split Records. If you want the CD or vinyl, there's like 30 LPs available still through Chaos Records. And I think Chaos took care of the CD version as well. This is fucking essential listening right here. Seriously, in 2019, if you did not give Impure Satan's Eclipse a listen, then you did not give 2019 a chance musically. But... Anyways, as always, thanks for watching. Thank you, Aaron, for doing an awesome tape trade. And hails to Impure for making such an awesome, awesome record. And Dennis for letting me know about it. As well as John Randall for helping me snag the LP version. Fuck yes. Keep killing Christ. But, like I said, as always, thanks for watching. You fucking rule. Hey, what's up?